Hello everyone and welcome to Tuesday. I hope everybody is doing well. I really and truly do. My name is Mel from Melamori Nursery and I have got on this beautiful baby boy. Oh my goodness. He is just dreamy, this little fella. You see him? This is the leaf sculpt by Bountiful Baby. And he is a weensy little fella, very tiny. He weighs barely, oh, I want to say, oh, look at him. He barely weighs about three, three and a half pounds at most, I would think. And he was beautifully reborn by Jen over at Inspired by Babies. I will leave her link in the description box below. I love this sculpt. He's got very long limbs, very long arms, longer than like normal clothes would fit like a preemie, even though he is a preemie. Um, and he just moves like a dream. Oh my goodness. As you can tell, it's a beautiful sunny day. And uh, look at the movement of this little boy. I haven't wanted to reweight him because he does move really well. And um, we're just going to change him into a little sleeper today. And... call it a day and put this little fella back to bed. It's been a while since he's been on. Yeah. So what I was going to put him in is a um, undershirt. This is from Granimals. It is a preemie size and it's uh, blue. Well, it's white actually. It has blue stripes and a darker I think that's blue yeah it's a darker blue and it looks like I don't know what the camera's picking up maybe it's the sunlight but it's white blue and darker blue stripes with the blue trim around all of the edges the neckline the arm and the legs and then I'm just going to put him in this new uh, Child of Mine Carter's Preemie Shark Sleeper so this falls under new doll clothes as well from Jay over at Jay Dolls UK. It's time we got him out of this lion and elephant and giraffe outfit. He's got his little, I've got two of these actually. I've called this one Oscar. So Leaf has his little lovey with him. And I had this hat on him, which is a little bear hat. But I've removed that. And he has a pacifier, which is blue, which looks absolutely massive on his little face. Look at that. Oh, Isn't he sweet, folks? So, yeah, he is just going to get changed today. I don't think he has another undershirt on. Look at him. He's taken off his sock already. He reminds me of my new grandbaby in a way even though my new grandbaby is a lot bigger than Leaf. He is just back up to his birth weight of seven pounds, eight ounces. Babies lose a couple of ounces, you know, after they're born. And um, with preemies here, you've got to be ultra careful because sometimes if they're very preemie, um, their skin is very delicate and tender. And I remember when my first grandson was born. Um, let's take that baby boy. Let's take that. Even though my, my new grandson, he'll cry. He doesn't like to be changed. He has that kind of cry, you know, where they go, ah, 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 you know, that cry. Um, but yeah, 
my first grandson when he was born was in the hospital for a while because he was born with his insides um, on the outside of his body and that included his intestinal system so he had to stay in the hospital till not only the surgery was done and complete but until he could have a normal bowel movement which was a really big deal um, and took took about a good three weeks so let's check that diaper out this is his construction here folks and um i don't know how his diaper is well it seems good looks like we didn't have much of a problem there I find when I cover the babies up that the diapers don't oxidize as quickly. This was a newborn size, the outfit that I had on him. And I had it on him because his arms are really long. So I'm curious to see if this new, this preemie outfit will fit him because he does have very, very long. You see how long and skinny his limbs are? Yeah, I love this little finger here, and I love how his hand can go across his face like that. So, little boy, let's get this other little onesie on you. It's a little muscle shirt onesie, but it does have a one snap that we can put on a little more gently for you. I'm trying to think what is new. Well, uh, this is my daughter's last week of work here um, before she moves. And that's a pretty, I don't know, it's been a pretty stressful thing for me, I suppose, because on the one hand, you know, I, I oh, honey, what's going on here? Mom, I can't get your arm in. I am not doing this well. There we go. There we go. Um, on the one hand, I'm so happy for her. And on the other hand, I'm going to miss her like crazy, folks. Like crazy. And uh, I know I've spoken of this before. But she has been such a blessing to have home. And... You get used to that, you know, I get used to that. And I love having somebody here that I can nurture and, and, um, and knowing that she won't just be down the street or a car ride away, she'll be on a ferry, you know, but I mean, I'm happy for her too. So I, I think I'm more happy for her than you know anything else look how cute he looks in this onesie oh my goodness look at him oh look at those little legs let's turn you over to see what you look like that way little boy yeah he's so tiny so tiny and his little legs cross over got this arm protecting him. Oh, there he goes. He was the first little guy that I brought back after my surgery. I remember it was like, I didn't know how I was going to record videos and, and uh, it was such a blessing to have one. He has beautiful vein in, in his feet. Let me show everybody. Let's see if we can show everybody this beautiful veining you've got in your feet. <laughs> Let's see. I don't know if you guys can see it. Maybe my camera is not the best, but it's been done really well. Let's get this little 
sleeper on you. It'll probably be a very quick little video today, folks. Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays are my busiest days. Every week, the same kind of thing. What are your busiest days of the week? Do you guys have a busy day of the week? Let's get you brought up, little boy. Yeah, I'm almost thinking he's a newborn size because even though he's wearing this preemie outfit here, I'm wondering if it's gonna... I think I wondered this before. But I like the white and blue on him, definitely. Okay, little boy. It's amazing to me how reborns, you know, they don't cry, they don't poop, they don't pee. They just lie for us while we change them. One of the things I enjoy the most of this hobby, of course, is the clothing because you know, they don't ruin the clothing. No sooner had I changed my grandson that he'd, you know, spit up all over his new outfit and had to be changed again. I mean, you know. <clears throat> so this one looks pretty good for his arms. Yeah, there he is. There's his little lovey. There's your little lovey leaf. Aww. Yeah, he's beautiful. I'm just going to quickly do his hair. And uh, I should be using a toothbrush, actually, on his hair because he was rooted really, really well as well. And he's got a nice little swirl going on. Maybe I can show you that too. But yeah, I really love the fashion aspect of this hobby. The clothing. I think that's where I kind of excel. <laughs> Not that I'm saying I'm good at, you know, picking, you know, fashionable clothing. Probably not. Um... Because at this stage of the game, sleepers are what I would, I would, you know, and my daughter's the same way. Like, at this, when they're this small, they just want sleepers and onesies and, you know, let's get that little swirl going on for you, little man. Yeah, he... If this little boy was like a real baby, you know what I'm saying? He'd be such a good little thing laying here while I'm doing his hair. Let's see if I got that swirl right. Come here, Leaf. See, look at how beautifully he is rooted. And that's me doing hair, folks. I mean, I'm not the greatest. But he is such a beautiful little boy. Just gorgeous. Well, little man, let's lay you down with your little Oscar lovey, a little puppy dog. Oh, we'll give him a soother. Oh, he's sleepy. Well, folks, it's a short and sweet little video. Let me know in the comments below what your busy day of the week is and uh, and I thank you very much for stopping by and watching me change this sweet little boy I pray everybody is doing well and all of you are healthy and remember folks we're perfectly imperfect we're loved needed and wanted far, far more than you'll ever know. And I will see you all next time. Bye for now.